Uh, I will take a short time of you today in order to tell about our new platform called Inflow Bridge. So two years ago, when we first started Inflow, um, most of you know we have a concept called B2I meetings, which means brand to influencer meetings. So in order to make these meetings happen, those influencers and brands should uh, schedule their meetings before the event. In order to do that, we created a really simple software. But then we wanted to add some features on it, like um, because brands were asking to us, how should we decide who to meet? How should we decide who to send a meeting request um, about influencers? That's why we started adding some statistics about influencers, some real-time data of the influencers about um, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter. Starting from that point, the software got bigger, 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 and then right now Inflow Bridge is a standalone product apart from Inflow Events. It's a software as a service uh, project that we will be going online in the next a couple of months. I will show you a couple of features and screenshots from the software, um, just to give you an idea. So everyone is talking about data. And of course, we are talking about influencer marketing. It's all based on the data, because the brands are making their decisions according to the data on the Instagram, according to the engagement rate, according to the like rate, according to the comments, according to the um, follower rate, etc. So data is everywhere right now. But in order to make really smart decisions, the data should be analyzed and also transformed into a version that can be understandable. And that's what we are trying to do on Inflow Bridge. Because it's, uh, become, it becomes really more and more difficult to manage influencer relationships, to select, to discover, to decide on who to work with, and also to analyze post-campaign. So InfoBridge is just the right tool that we plan to deliver in the next months. Um, a couple of features of InfoBridge platform. Right now, the software is capable of 10 million data. Data is engagement in this case, likes, comments, views, etc. everything about your social media posts, um, processing daily, and also total of 5 million like analysis multi. So like analysis is really, really important because looking at the Instagram likes or YouTube or, or Twitter fabs or, or retweets, we can understand how your followers are reacting to your content. So we also partnered with Google Cloud. We, uh, the, the software is accepted to a uh, um, Google Cloud partnership program for startups. So um, we wanted to create some, some metrics, some, some figures, in order to make easier to understand uh, while reading the data. We have three metrics. The first one is the Info Health Score. Info Health Score is actually showing the reliability of your followers, mostly. And um, the second one is, I think it's, it's my favorite, and it's one of the most effective figures that you can see, is the purchasing power score of your followers. We can get the purchasing power score from 0 to 100 from, uh, for your followers by looking at their engagements their likes, their check-ins, their content they, they post publicly. And another ratio is the Info Power Score, which is the combined combination of those two others and some other uh, metrics as well. And this is the discovery page. You can, as a brand or as an agency, you can search um, and discover influences by platform, category, location, and engagement. By the way, just uh, just an information, as an influencer, you don't have to be registered to here because if your data and account is public, you are already in the platform. And for influencers, I think this might be a really cool feature for influencers. I know 
as influencers, you are sending lots of media kits to agencies, to the brands, because they are asking your media kits, your, your, uh, your performance metrics, your report, most of the time. You are preparing them, you are cre creating them, but it's, it's static, it's not real time. Once you created a media kit on PDF, it's, it will stay there. Two months later, you will have to create another one because your numbers changed, your performance changed. So that's why we created a real-time media kit for influencers that you can share with the agencies or brands whenever you want. And this page will show you, will show them the real-time data of your account. It's like a landing page for influencers. And another cool feature is the trending page. Apart from specific influencer data, we wanted to show everyone who uses the platform what's happening. What's happening on Instagram, what's happening on YouTube in the last seven days, in the last 30 days. So if you're a brand and using InfoBridge platform, you can go to trends page and you can see in the last seven days which is the most, um, which is the one, which is the post that got most engagement or most like, or most comment. You can do it, you can filter it for the last 30 days as well. Even you can filter it for some languages as well in order to make it uh, some, some specific regions. So this is like a very short summary of what we have been doing as Inflow Bridge, and it will come to you in March 2019. Influencers can use the platform for their own use, for free, uh, but brands has, have to pay a little bit amount of money. Um, yeah, um, and yeah, that was the whole story. This isn't supposed to be shown here right now. Thank you for listening to me. Oh.